In this tutorial, I'm going to go over how to attach an object with gravity to your rope. So that way, the rope will handle the object like as if it has weight to it. So what I'm going to do first is, again, I could work within the editor or within the actor itself. But I'm going to start with the ed within the editor first. So I'm going to drag out a cube. Just center this, okay? It's not completely centered, there we go. Next, I wanna make sure the options to simulate physics are on. And for the collision, I want to be set to block all. The problem is when I hit play, this is going to drop to the floor and the rope is just gonna stretch with it. So press play and it does this. I can push this, and you'll see that the rope is going with it, but that's not what I want. I want the rope to hold onto it in air. So, what I need to do is go into my rope settings. Click on my rope, and type in create. Next, you'll see under the attachment area, an option that says create tension constraints for simulating rigids. I want to have that selected. Close this and now press play. You'll now see that the rope is holding on to the cube as if there are no problems. Within the cube properties, you can change some things within the physics. For example, the mass. You can change this to change how heavy the block will be. All these options you can change to get the desired effect you want. Next, what I'm going to do is open up my longer rope right there. Go to viewport and just add just go to create and I just want to compile that. This. So that way now I can come over here and add the cube. Now the cube only has to touch in one section. And I'm, what I mean is like this. It doesn't have to fully be in it, just about right there. And I can hit play now. You'll now see that it is attached. And it's dropping as it should be. Again, you can mess with the properties of the cube or your object to get the desired effect that you want. Now if I wanted to, I can delete these cubes. I can come into my rope component. And I could add the cube in there. And the same thing with the rope. This other room. Press play. Sorry, forgot to come in here and make sure gravity is enabled for the simulate physics and block all. And do the same thing with the other room. There we go. Now I have a component that I can just grab and move wherever I like. So I can do this 
and add more of them if I want to. Like that. And that's how you can create an object that can attach to your VD rope component and um, have some gravity to it.